Think about it. The undies we wear now fail us every single month. There's a new product on the market, period proof pens. You have got to be kidding me. I cannot do this story alone. Sasha, help me out. Why are you so uncomfortable talking about menses? Oh, that, that word alone? Ooh. Well, I'm Sasha Wood. <clears throat> and I'm Mike McCrudden talking about the Think Underwear. Here for you on IO. Oh my god, we'd be sick. Would any of our female viewers out there be interested in exchanging their pads and tampons for a product like this? Let me know in the comments down below. Oh my gosh, you have got to be kidding me. Girls will not be wearing anything but these underwear? That's gross. Michael can't handle this, so I'm gonna tell you exactly how this product works. So what Thinks is attempting to do is replace the one-use pads and tampons with a product that is completely reusable. And this is Thinks, an underwear that's gonna have a built-in pad-like component that can be washed and reused. And it's also supposed to be fashionable, so you can still feel nice wearing like dainty, frilly things even while you're menstruating. Now in the promotional video they pumped out on YouTube, they actually refer to these things as being bulletproof. Is that for real? Like that? Batman underwear? I think they're trying to be a bit more clever like in the fact that Menzies travels through blood and so hence the panties would be bulletproof in the sense they can handle any blood that's gonna flow through them. But I don't know because blood is a notoriously hard stain to get out. So we'll see. Let's just keep on thinking about Batman. Don't like the story. On top of all this, Thanks is actually trying to promote a very altruistic message. That's right. Thanks is actually donating money from each pair sold to organizations out in Uganda, providing girls with pads so they can go to school when they have their periods. Currently, I'm told there's these things like period huts. I don't know, Sasha knows all about it. Well, menstrual huts aren't common, they are still in existence in some places. However, what most likely happens is that these girls with no products to staunch the flow of their menstruation, well, they just simply can't go to school, and so they end up missing the week or however many days for which their period lasts. So Michael, you've been so skeezed out this whole time. What is it about this that freaks you out so much? It's just that one word. It doesn't work for me. Which one? Menses? Ah, oh, nails on a chalkboard. Ugh. Also, I got a little bit of a concern about these underwear going in the laundry machine. Like with everything else, I feel I like... I think they'd have to go by themselves, for yeah. sure. Like you can't wash them in a regular load. Blood no. on everything. Because this used to be a white shirt. <laughs> and then you put it in there? What? <laughs> We're, why are we both wearing red? How did that... Wow. It's subliminal messaging. Wonderful. My name's Michael McCrudden. And I'm Sasha Wood. Let us know, guys, would you pick up a pair of these for yourself in the comments down below? And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe for more videos, which are over there. Are they here? Yeah, they're over there. And they're Menzies free. <laughs>